first carbohydrate. So we've been in, in, in Jutsu Katana for um, how long? Like, yeah, three, like weeks. three weeks, right? Mm -hmm. Three weeks, yeah, three weeks. Um, thank you so much, uh, Ninjutsu, for sending it out. Really mm -hmm. appreciate it because it did send it out. And okay, so let's talk about build quality. Build quality wise, I think it feels solid, right? Yeah, it, it it's it's solid. I don't have a complaint on, on build quality. Like, didn't creak on me. Um, no rattling, Nothing, right? Yeah. Um, I couldn't tell anything with the clicks, honestly. Uh, personally, you know. Yeah, me. Either. Um, side buttons are pretty good too. I, yeah. I, 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 again, again, the build quality. I just didn't have any complaints. Now, I do no. have complaints, right? Yes. But I would say that's just me pick uh, the picking on the muscle. Yes. We'll go more into that later. Yeah. So. Come, I think you mentioned something about the coding not being like. So that's one of the things yeah. I was gonna pick, right? Yeah. Uh, the coding for me personally. I don't like it. Um, it feels like it's gonna slip out of my hand. Yeah. Honestly, it's not. It's just. It's just not grippy, man. I. I, I don't. I don't like the coating on it. Um, it's not terrible. Like you no, know, it's it, not. No, it, it's not terrible. It's you know, not like you know what coating sucked. I didn't like the freaking. Uh, the vans. The, no, the egg. The vans. No, no, no. But see, that one was still grippy. The, oh no, it was. It was slippery nah, too. Was but slippery no, you, you know which one I like. We tried. The, I didn't like that we tried recently. The extra five miles. The only the M forty eight or whatever the hell that that. That G Pro wireless mini yeah, one, yeah, yeah, that yeah, yeah, coding yeah. sucks. Yeah, that coding sucks. That coding yeah, sucks. Yeah, that. This that one's better than that. This one's yeah, better for than sure. That. Yeah, I it, it slightly better, but yeah, it was yeah. it was it, it was better. Yeah, it you just don't feel it, locked in. Yeah, 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 it, yeah it, that's, it doesn't, it doesn't give you that locked in feeling. Yeah. but it's not to mm -hmm. me at least. It's not terrible. It's not really bad. No, it's again. I felt I I felt worse coatings, but that the 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 coating the thing is the coating is something that I just personally didn't like. Yeah. Again, that stuff that I'm just nitpicking, right? Yeah. Um, it doesn't leave any sort of like grease stains or no, anything like that, like right? So if so like if that. that's what you're if that's what you're looking for and if you're concerned about that, no, it it, it won't it won't leave. It that. doesn't. Um, I think the moss is well balanced. That's what I I feel like makes it feel even like, lighter. Even lighter. Yeah. yeah, yeah it's yeah, just yeah. really well balanced. It is. Um, it is well balanced. Post travel, peace, pre travel. Um. Very minimal, right? When it comes to the um, the post travel, like almost nothing. Like it's a mm -hmm. solid mouse, mm -hmm. right? The feet, I have an issue with the feet. They're pretty good, you know. Um, but the one, the main thing, right? Our our main issue. And I think we both agree on this, right? Mm -hmm. Is the shape, right? The shape. Yeah, the shape. So for me, at least, see, this is a, this is a claw grip mouse in my opinion. It's strictly mm -hmm. claw grip, right? Mm -hmm. Um, and it almost reminds me of the XM one. Like, it was smaller, right? But it doesn't... It doesn't... It's not as good as I... It's not as good as I thought it was going to be. You know? Yeah. It's, it's not... Mm -hmm. It's not that... That great. Um, So, one of the issues I realized is that that hump right here, that's mm -hmm. supposed to be tall, it's too... It, it just feels... It doesn't feel that great. I don't know how to... I don't know, I don't know how to, to put mean. it. Yeah, it's not, yeah, not going to be it's as a, high It's a small morning. mouse. You know? Yeah. If it was maybe slightly bigger... I think I'll like it a little more, but this is like, it's just too small for me. I, I couldn't, I couldn't, I was for like days, I was trying to figure out how to grip it. Mm -hmm. I'll move my hand up on top so that my, so my palm was more at the top. Mm -hmm. I'll, uh, I'll claw it like I usually claw the mice and I just, I just couldn't play at my best. Now, the sensor and all that stuff, that was an issue. The build claw, that was mm -hmm. an issue. Clicks were good. Like they're pink dots, Juano pink dots. I mm -hmm. like these, I like the clicks, mm -hmm. right? Um, but I just couldn't play that that well with it, dude. Yeah, no, I I mean I palm grip my mouse, so yeah. I, I knew I wasn't gonna be the 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 most hugest fan on it. One of one of the things I don't like is that, is that the butt over here if it, it flares out too much. So my ring finger kind of almost curves instead of it being flat. Like I'm used to. So if you look at the if you look at the X two, 
Oh, yeah. uh, the X2s, they're very, they, they're kind of flat. They ha they hardly have any curve on them. I guess I just got used to having the X2 being flat like that. So this this just doesn't feel, this is, you know, this doesn't sit yeah. well with me, right? Um, uh, but, but I mean, yeah, this, this is, this is legitimately, uh, an XM1 Mini. That's, this is yeah. what it is. It's literally an XM1 yeah. Mini. So if you ever had the curiosity of being like, oh, I want, I like the XM1, but it's too big for me. You want to try, oh, by, by the way, a tiny mouse. Yeah. Because I, because I would honestly recommend this to like small handed people. We're 16 it's, by 9, right? So anything against smaller than that, right? We, we, we could like, look, I'm not saying that we, that we can't use it. We could use it, right? It's just, um. We prefer bigger mics, you know. Slightly bigger, uh, a slight, a slight, just like how you said, a slightly bigger version of this, I think, would have been be better for us. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, this is a tiny mouse. I was also surprised how tiny it was too. Um, uh, yeah, but like certain things that I liked about the XM1, the regular size uh, XM1, yeah. when you made it mini here with you know like this one, I just, I just, I just didn't like like the sides flare way too much for me to, you know, for me to enjoy it. Um, uh. Not a bad shape. I just don't think it was for us, honestly. Yeah. The the, the, the shape just wasn't for us. Yeah. They didn't, they didn't really, they didn't really match with me. Yeah. So the only, what we're saying discourage oh, yeah, from no. buying it no, because no, no. the shape just wasn't for us, right? Everything. It's what happens? It, yeah, yeah. It, it happens. You run into my. We run into mice that are good. Their mm -hmm. build quality is good, mm -hmm. but they're just not for us, right? Mm -hmm. And this is one of them, right? That's yeah, one of them. Yeah. Um, everything like we mentioned before, everything mm -hmm. about it was top tier when it comes mm -hmm. to like build quality and clicks and the sensor right i think battery life was actually pretty damn good i remember charging it maybe like twice i don't i don't, I don't, I don't even i don't even think i charged it the week yeah. that i had it so and then i just gave it to you <laughs> yeah yeah i think i've only charged it like twice right yeah 395 sensor everything about it is good dude there's no issues with the mouse at all yeah um, i couldn't find any it's just the shape right the shape and um personally i th i thought that having a smaller xm1 would be like a dream come true. Yeah. Right? But there's just something about making mice too small that they don't really translate too well. And I think we saw that with the um with the with the uh, what do you call it? I know there's mice that we reviewed that came out small. Like you like the X Lite V two? The X Lite, the, remember the mini? I don't think you liked that one as much. Oh yeah, yeah, right? yeah. Because yeah. it was just like yeah. a small. So regular X was cool, for, yeah. you know, for me, and I, I liked it. But then they made the mini, and I was like, "Oh, that's cool." And I tried it, and I was like, "No, I don't like it." You know? Yeah, but I liked so, it, yeah, right? See, so yeah. So it just depends. There, you know, there are mice that you're gonna they're gonna translate well when they make it mini, and then some that are not. But right? see, but that goes that just goes again that it just wasn't for us, right? Yes, I, I don't I don't exactly. think I don't think that has anything to do with them translating it well or not. That's just yeah. you just have to yeah, find it's out just what, personal what you like right? on, honestly. Yeah. And the, and this one was was it was just one of those cases, right? Yeah. Uh but uh, you know, but again for the price how much it was like ninety bucks, uh, right? I 90, think four ninety nine. Yeah. Ninety four ninety nine for a small X and one mini basically shape. That's, yeah, what, that's I think really that's what it pretty is. Damn good. I think I, I think know. it's good. Like if you're curious about it. I'd say go for it. I don't yeah, have any complaints. It it's not. It's not like I'm recommending you. You know, like a G Wolf mouse. Holy crap! Yeah. You know, yeah. a, a 4K, for 180, bucks, 150 bucks. bucks. That will blow no. up on you. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not doing that, dude. Like this. See, this is one of the reasons why we we just don't review yeah. G Wolf mice. Yeah. I'm not gonna do that to people. Like yeah. if I, if I don't like a product, and I genuinely don't like it, and I think yeah. the product's like, dude, what what the hell's yeah. going on here? I'm not. You know, you're not gonna see. Yeah. Those you know recommend it or yeah or review it i should say right yeah. it's not gonna it's not gonna be in the channel but this just because it wasn't for us doesn't mean it's not gonna be for you right exactly so. exactly yeah so um yeah again everything about the mouse was solid um sorry about the dogs right dogs. Let, let me, let me yeah we're gonna close the door on the dog right so it's a little less noisy okay. <laughs> you know what's funny hmm. this is when you really think about it, mm -hmm. this is exactly what you would imagine an XM1 meaning to be like. Yeah. Right? Yeah. This is the curves, yeah. the size and 100%. everything. And 100%. like you said, these curves are, they're, they're uh, aggressive for the mini size. I guess aggressive for the mini size, right? Because mm -hmm. you can feel it more, you know? Instead you of the, instead of the regular just... size, they're like, you have a longer path. It's because they curve too, way too uh, quickly. The, you know? the, yeah, the, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's exactly. what it is. Yeah. yeah, they curve way too quickly here towards the back. So it's, it's like, it, like if, if flares are a lot and then it kind of goes in and stuff. And so it makes my... My ring finger basically did this. I, I don't... Yeah. See, and the issue for me wasn't really the sides. I actually, you know, for Klein, aggressively calling mm -hmm. Klein, I like the way it feels, but I don't know what it is. There's just something that just... Maybe the hump at the back and it'd be taller. I'm thinking is that hump in the back. It needs to be maybe more to the mm -hmm. back or more to the front or something like mm -hmm. that, but... If you want to aggressively claw grip, you could do this. You could mm -hmm. do it with this mouse. It's... 
awesome. I like, I like, I, it's, I like, I like the way it feels when you gracefully claw grip, yeah. but I can't play that well with it. But yeah, if there's something that, if you want a small aggressively claw grip mouse, this may be, this may be it for you to be honest. Um, but yeah, um, I know like someone's making. I think they have. You can pre-order their mini, right? Can you? I'm, pre I'm, pre I'm, I'm pretty sure huh. you can. Somebody in the comments say that you could do that. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I saw on Twitter you, they they announced their mini version already. Huh. I, I think you can put pre-orders already on them. I think, I think it's like ninety bucks or like gonna be like a hundred bucks. Um, That's interesting. Uh, somewhere or, or around there. Um, I guess we we'll have to get one to really claim or or or, or theory that it is a, a mini. But I but I know what it is already. <laughs> um, but you know, we'll still eventually pick one up and XM1 yeah. mini, you know, and, and whatnot. But despite all that, we have the regular XM1. When we look at that, it's, this is literally just a mini version of it. So yeah, it's yeah. like, so yeah, if you're curious, yeah, that's a mini XM1. Yeah, basically. you don't have to wait, you can just get it right now, right? Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, basically. Pretty good mouse. Uh, can we recommend it? Yeah, yeah, we can recommend it. Yeah, 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 exactly. That, honestly, yeah. yeah, it's 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 way better than than the first mouse than their original one. Oh, Shade yeah. was cool. Man, they messed it up by throwing that third, 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 five cents. What were yeah, you thinking? Yeah, yeah. I, I am still very <laughs> pissed at that, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Other than that, you know, they've been making the Katana was a banger. Oh, it was a banger, yeah. This, this one, one is pretty good. It's right? a pretty, pretty good quality and, yeah. and everything. Just It just wasn't for us. Yeah. Yeah, so it's pretty much it, guys. If you guys want to pick one up, we're going to leave links down below. Thank you again, Ninjutsu, for saying mm -hmm. it out. I really appreciate it. Um, we can't wait to see what else you guys come up with next, right? Yeah. So, yeah. It's pretty much it, guys. It's Gus. And Carlos from Hardware Unplugged. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.